Right, what you're gonna learn is to get some text and make it look like it's on fire. So first of all you got your background, make it black, looks good in black. Text, make sure that's white, make a new layer, write whatever text you want. I'm gonna put that because it looks right when it's finished at the end on that. And this style, so one you have to download somewhere, can't be bothered to tell you where. <laughs> right, um, then what you do is get your smush tool, mm. so that just press OK. This is just to make it look like it's on fire. I'll turn Emerson off next time. Yes. Leave this as it is. Well, you went over the style, so it doesn't matter, but I'll leave it as it is because it looks better. No point in smudging it because it just make it look stupid. Just make a, I'm just making a rough one, so I went into too much detail with it. But you'll see you'll see effect after. See what it looks like. Looks good. Right. After you've done that, go here, this little button, create a new fill or adjustment layer, go to colour balance, and go on shadows, set this to 70, oh, 70, and that to minus 70, mid tones, do the same, 70, minus 70, and as you can see it's starting to make, look like it's on fire and highlights 70 and you want this about 20 as you can see it depends what, what you want it like so I'm going to set mine about 20 that's ok and as you can see it looks like it's on fire but it's not that good because I don't spend much time on it and then what you want to do is get another Text. Write out the same one, clearly. Oops. This time, put it in black. Put it all in black. Put it exactly over that. Over your one. Like, like that. And then. So, overlay, and as you can see, if you do that, it's like, you no, know, like, tones it up a bit, makes it look a bit more fiery. Right, and that's it. What you learned something from this, comment and write for me. Tell me what you think. Thank you, and goodbye.